Alright guys, how's it going? Today I am doing an unboxing video of the OLED Switch. Um, but yeah, so I'm assuming just here. See, it feels weird. I feel like I should have like a second angle, but I don't. Alright, so. Let's turn it this way. So, ooh. First of all, you have. Make sure I'm not blocking the mic. You have your Switch. 7 inch display OLED obviously uh, your two joy cons one I'm going to compare them to my custom ones to see if they feel any different okay. okay straight from the start I can tell this screen is way nicer um, it's a lot I like the feel on the back as well. It's more of a plasticky feel than a, a shiny plastic. It's, it's matte. It's, it's more matte than a glossy. And this one's just picking up thumbprints and it's wearing. I expect this one might do the same over time, but for now, that's fine. You've got that new stand. There it is. So this one has a stand that goes completely, um, I'd say, what is it, almost 180. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do b-roll shots so you can see this a lot okay and underneath we have the dot oh, Jesus Christ I'm struggling okay so it's a white dot obviously I got the white set so I don't want to go with black again like I did with my last one okay so it's got a redesign so it's not just the same there it is Bring up the other one for comparison. Alright, so here's the old one, and here's the new one. There's slightly different. Uh, so the it's more curved around it. It's actually rounded rather than like a square rounded edge. It's just like straight up curved. The backs. Oh god, it's already picking up dirty fingerprints. The backs, uh, as you can tell, this one has a curved output i guess you could say for the cables and this one's just like a tiny little hole for it to come through um this one it's back just swings out it holds there it's quite awkward to get cables through and then this one let me be careful with this this one just comes straight off it's just a clip clip on just clips into the bottom and then just folds up but it's got a uh, USB-C, HDMI, and an Ethernet port now, so, you know, I mean, the wi is still going to be dog shit, but at least it might be a little bit better with the wired Ethernet, but it's nothing too new, because you could get the adapter beforehand, and the box, you obviously get the power cable, the exact same as last time, I think it's a little, it's more rounded this time, let's get that out, there it is, yeah, it is more or less the same it's just it looks a little smaller actually but, um yeah i put this one in then you've got the hdmi cable i'm gonna keep that in there because i've already got one it's just a basic hdmi cable there are uh, rumors or like possibilities going around it's a 2.0 cable not a 4.0 or 1.4 like the original switch had and the wii before that um which can allow 4k 60 uh, pass through or 60 fps um, because there has been things going around where the dot will be able to handle um, 4k output eventually and they have noticed you can get updates for the dock um, unlike the original dock unlike the original dock where it's just it's just a dock but this one they found chips underneath the hdmi ports i'm not going to get into it because i'm sure as hell i'm not going to take it apart because i can't afford that um, underneath, it's just the same old Joy-Con holder, it looks the exact same, now we've got two, that's exciting, what are they called, straps, that's the one, uh, they've got little patterns on them, don't know what that's about, but I mean it's cool, also I hope you appreciate this little setup I've got going on, I've got no space to move around here, I had to crawl under the desk um, to get here, it was all very awkward and embarrassing, but now I'm here and it's kind of comfy. Right, that was everything. I'm just going to put all the wrapping back into the box. <laughs>
Oi. I'm not very good at this. Right, let's do first time start. Uh, is that on a different side? No, it's not. Okay. Right, let's do it then. On. Oh, yeah. oh my god, that screen looks so good. Those the black is black. Right there, right. All right. That was delayed, but okay. Oh wow! That, oh, the screen is just. Dunum is just perfect. The speed, all oh, the the sound is better. It's got a bit more bass to it. And there we go. All set up. The NC screen, 50% battery. So if we go into settings, so I'm like looking around, I can barely see it. If we go to, okay, themes are still the same. TV output, system, see update dot. So this, the dot, this dot can be updated, which is gotta mean something. Why would you need to update a dot? So this, it says it, it comes with 64 gigabytes instead of 32, um, but, I've got 55 or 54.9 um, because it doesn't like me. We've got 40% battery. The battery is improved on this one like they did with the version 2 of the original Switch. It's going to last a lot longer. I keep on looking at the TV, it's so distracting. It's going to last a lot longer um, than this one. This one lasts like a couple hours maybe, three hours at most, not even that. And I've just got to plug it in to carry on using it. I've never really uh, thought about how long it takes, but after seeing all these videos of how long their switch battery has lasted them it has been quite a dramatic increase i'm going to put in breath of the wild and see how it runs oh yeah also uh people are mentioning how the the uh, card slot is hard to open let's try it first time oh wow yeah there's like no divot there now i've got like no nails either so my i can't i can't get my nail in there how am I meant to open this? Okay, yeah, this is a down. This is the worst part of the switch. I've got an SD card here. There we go. It's open. We got it. I might just leave it open. <laughs> it's done. It's sorted. Right, let's put the game in. There it is. Breath of the Wild. It just looks way better in quality. Like it, it OLED on a 720p screen. You think it's meh, but. Don't forget, it's, a, it's still a small screen. If it was 720p OLED TV or monitor, then yeah, you're going to notice it. But on a, on a screen this big, you ain't going to notice. Okay, so after a bunch of hassle, I finally got my account on the new Switch. I uh, can remember my password for the life of me. Oh, yeah. Definitely an improvement. Yeah, like I said, this is during a save when I hadn't really got very far. I had to go find like the four beasts. I still don't quite know what it means. Yeah, you, you, it's hard to tell on this character. The 700D, it's it's not great. Um, yeah, the the screen looks way more vibrant. I will be doing a separate video on uh, games, so be sure to check that out. It should be uploaded not long after this one, maybe a couple of days. So uh, be sure to subscribe. Yeah, yeah, got that. Okay. What the fuck? <laughs> oh look at that back screen that looks great that looks so vibrant anyway guys if you did enjoy this video be sure to drop a like down below comment what you think about a switch OLED. are you picking one up are you going to stick to the original if you've already got one have you got a switch light maybe you're going to upgrade to the oled if you got a switch light and you want a bigger screen i'd recommend it if you want to wait for something that is currently unannounced for a switch pro which we thought the oled was going to be maybe you want to wait it out maybe something will be announced but i i have a feeling this is going to be the the main switch for a couple years uh, hopefully at least two or three two and a half um because i i don't i don't want to upgrade again to be honest i've had this one for almost four years i got it in 2018 anyway i hope you did enjoy be sure to like comment and subscribe i'll see you guys soon goodbye